I be the surrogate father of Betty's baby? The spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. Go for it. Uh, yes. Uh, thanks a lot. Send her in. Oh, hi, Betty. Hi, hi Cheese Pup. What a surprise. Betty has some questions for you, Carl. Uh, questions? What, what kind of questions? Well, since you've agreed to help me conceive this child, there's just a couple questions I'd like you to answer. Carl, Betty's family is not without notoriety. She comes from a very old family. With a pure bloodline, she has to be very careful who fathers her child. Okay, uh, start with the questions. Okay, let's see here. Okay, uh, let's see. Any history of mental illness? No. Uh, well, except for my Uncle Henry. Now, he used to like to dress up in women's clothing and pretend to be Gypsy Rosalie, but uh, he wasn't crazy, he just liked to have a lot of fun, okay? <laughs> And anyway, he wasn't related to me by blood. It was by marriage, so okay. I guess that doesn't count. Okay, good. Uh, any physical deformities? Uh, no. Drink? Uh, socially. Smoke? No. Drugs? No. Carl? Okay, might all. Uh, but only when I have a really bad headache, all right? <laughs> okay, let's see here. Uh, uh no, no. Uh, the hypotenuse of an isosceles triangle. Come on, Betty, is that an important question? No, no, no. I just kind of threw that in there. Okay, um, well, I have one last question, and you've got to get it right. If you don't get it right, the whole thing is off. So, uh, what does the black widow spider do after mating? Uh, oh, well, listen, I would like to answer that right now, but I have a very important business meeting I have to attend, so uh, why don't we finish that this evening when I get home? Oh, okay. Okay, we can do that, can't we? Okay, great. Bye, Betty. Bye. Bye, Cheese Puff. Bye. Get rid of the twit receptionist. Yeah, okay. Sure. Yeah, hello, Bob. This is Mr. F. Uh, you got to help me out. Uh, any way I can, Mr. F. I've got uh, a few minutes uh, before I have to stir the compost heap. Okay, listen, Bob. What does the black widow spider do after mating? Black widow spider, you say? Now, that's the most fascinating creature in the arachnid family. Not only distinctive by having the red hourglass on her abdomen, but by her unique behavior after mating. Uh, what do you mean? Don't you know, Mr. F? The black widow always kills her partner after mating. Seems to me we have a sect of the Black Widow cult right here in Midville. I read something about it in the paper the other day. It's this group of women, and they actually sacrifice men after luring them into a sexual encounter. Uh, did I answer your question, Mr. F? Yeah, more than you know, Bob. Uh, listen, talk to you later. Okay, bye. bye. What? See. I hope no one sees us here. Oh God, it'll be all over the bridge club. Like it's a killer day today, isn't yes, it? Yes, it is. You know, I think that would look totally hot on you. Do you really think it's me? I think it screams her name. By the way, what is her name? I'm Mama McGillis. That's my daughter and her friend over there. Well, what are you looking for today? What I'm really looking for is something awesome and accessories. Well, our accessory table is right over here. Oh, my. Of course, you know that the new trend in fashion is wearing a whole bunch of necklaces at the same time. Oh, look at this. Mm, mm, mm. How about a bracelet? Mm -hmm. That was episode two of Oh, Those Fletchmans. And stay tuned for more episodes just like that one. It's really exciting stuff, folks.